Well, Dan, while it's not exactly good news, both Sears and Osh are major contributors to the city's sales tax. The business closures will hardly put a dent in the city's sales tax here. Taken together, there's probably $180,000 in tax money over the course of a year we're looking at. The announcement that Sears is going out of business wasn't a big surprise. The struggling chain had closed its auto repair shop in February 2017. But the Osh closure came as a surprise. Capitola Mayor Mike Termini feels optimistic that it won't take long to get a new business tenant on board. The buildings haven't disappeared. If they're empty for two or four months, it's not going to be the end of the world. We'll take a little bit of a hit and we'll get something even better in there. While Capitola has lost two of its top 15 retailers, the Aptos Village project is adding five new ones. Joining the Anchor Store, New Leaf, are local businesses, including the Penny Ice Creamery, the Sock Shop and Shoe Company, and a new-to-the-area restaurant led by Michelin three-star chef David Kinch. Other than a couple of restaurants that are going to be new, but very exciting, David Kinch is a big name, I think it will give all of us a chance to do what we want to do, shop locally. While the closure of the two major chains, but the expansion of some local businesses, we asked Teresa Tomei, who is the Director of Small Business Development Center at Cabrillo College, just what is the climate for the future? We all know how, how strong and how hot the economy is right now, and should that continue, that's always a good beacon for small businesses because it means people have money to spend in the stores and in the businesses. And there's been a constant flow of people going in and out of Osh behind me here, taking advantage of the 10 to 30 percent sales going on. Dan? And what a history in California that is going away. Thank you very much. Appreciate it, Phil. Sears stores could begin uh, sale liquidations as early as next week. The Appetite Village project is scheduled to open in 2019.